Hi, hello everyone. I am Natsu from Avaniko Technologies. So today we're going to talk about eWable and eWable integration with SAP Business One. Right. So imagine a situation where a vendor is in one place and the customer is in another place. Okay. So they're going to transport goods from this place to that place. So probably the goods value will be less, but the invoice will be very less value. In that case, isn't it illegal to do that? So that is why the government of India and the Central Board of Excise and Customs have come up with a concept called eWable. eWable is actually electronic wayable. It is a 12-digit number. It comes under the Section 68 of GST Act and Section 138 of the GST Act rule of 2017. So when the goods value is above 50,000 and when it's getting transported in a motorized vehicle, this eWable is mandatory. It can be the interstate or intrastate, it doesn't matter. So basically, eWable is a key for anti-tax evasion system and it's a crucial part of GST architecture. Okay, so now let us see why this eWable is very important in our country. Okay, since India is digitally progressing nowadays, this eWable is come in life. Okay, you don't need to put eWable by, you don't need to generate eWable by going into the GST portal and generating it. It is not a very tedious process. Just logging into the eWable portal Give all the details of the invoice, get it printed and give it to the transporter while transporting, which means it has a very user friendly portal and it's very easy to take it. And moreover, since it avoids tax evasion, it is must for each and every invoice to have an eWable with it. OK, so when we talk about eWable, many people would have numerous questions about eWable. And we at Avanico have come across few questions and we are here to answer you for that. OK, what is the first question? What are the documents that are important for the generation of eWable? Yes, it's a very good question, right? And it's very important too. Documents like invoice copy or bill of supply or delivery chalan is very important for the generation of eWable. I repeat, the invoice copy the, or the delivery chalan or the bill of supply, it's very important. And that has to have the transporter ID and the transporter vehicle uh, ID, vehicle number and other details with it. So that is very important for the generation of eWable. Okay. I have generated the eWable, but for how many days this eWable is valid, right? It's a very important question. And to answer that, there's a very small calculation in it. For every 100 kilometer, the eWable is valid for one day, which means if I'm going to transport my goods for 450 kilometers, so 400 plus 50, which means my eWable is valid for five days. But if it is an over-dimensional cargo, for every 20 kilometers, my eWable is valid for one day. So if I'm going to transport my goods for 44 kilometers in an over-dimensional cargo, my the validity of eWable is three days. But this validity will end in the last day of the month. Okay, so the third question. If I've generated the eWable, but I haven't transported the goods, so what should be done in that case? Very sorry, you have to just cancel the eWable, and that cancellation should be done within 24 hours. Else, nothing can be done. And what happens? If the vehicle gets breakdown in the middle or some accident happened, right? In that case, what happens to the validity of the eWable? Very good question. What the government of India does is in the part B of the eWable 01, they have given a column to fill these details. You can just go there, fill why these details, why these accidents or natural calamities or law and order issues, why this has happened. We can just give these details so that the validity of the eWable can be extended. Or what if I give some wrong entries or what if I make some mistakes in the eWable? How can it be re rectified? You can't just edit or change the eWable. The only possibility is you have to cancel it. And deleting the eWable option is not a pos is also not possible. Only you have to cancel the eWable and then with the new details, generate a new one. Okay. So what are the items which are exclusive of the eWable? Okay. While I'm transporting the perishable items like fish, meat, milk, etc., or while I'm transporting gold, silver, um, 
handloom silk uh, and those items the available is not necessary there and also while i'm transporting the goods through a non motorized vehicle say like bullock carts or cycles in that case also available is not necessary and also when i'm transporting the goods from customs port air cargo to the inland container depot in those cases also available is not necessary and also not only in this cases even if the available is less even if the invoice value is less than 50000 you can generate an available and it's entirely your choice in those cases there is a common portal for the unregistered vendors for them to generate the available okay so if i'm going to export or import the goods should i generate an available very good question yes we have to do it because both the exports and imports is considered as interstate transactions so in that case the importer has to generate an available and the exporter is liable to get the available through the available portal and while entering the vehicle number uh, which is a very important thing in available we have to do it without spaces take for example my vehicle number is tn05 be45 in that case i have to type the number is tn 05 be 0045 i mean the last four last digit should be only four digits and that should be given without space okay we have seen what are the important questions that we see while get talking about the evable and now i'll tell you how to generate the evable yes we can generate the evable by directly logging inside the evable portal and giving those details and then taking a print out of it and giving it to the transporter or as discussed already we can then send it to the sms for that case we have to then register the mobile number with the available portal it's a one time process but when you do it you can directly generate or cancel the available through the sms itself and there are suvitha providers which means the third party providers and the last thing we have api api means application programming interface and that avanico has come up with the solution called integrating sap business one with evable portal since we are specializing in sap business one we've integrated the evable portal with sap business one okay so we we have developed something called add on wherein uh, we create a link between these two so that whenever the end user puts an invoice in sap invoice in sap business one automatically the evable will get generated in the evable portal a mail will be received to the registered uh, mail address likewise an attachment will be sent to the invoice and also more specifically the evable number will get displayed in the invoice very interesting right yes that is we have done through api api means side to side integration of two systems the first system is it system or any erp solution that we are using and the second one is the evable portal using this we have generated the link very good but what are the advantages of this api one thing usually what the normal system does is they enter all the details in the sap business one or probably any erp solution and then they take the same details and go into the evable portal re enter it again with all the details and then they take a print out of it and with the generated evable number they update it in the sap business one or again any other erp solution and then they take a print out of the invoice number it's a very tedious process right but here just imagine just put the details in the sap business one and get the evable generated automatically to your mail so that is what we have done through add on in order to know such details or do that application integration for your company do see the comments uh, get back to us for further queries we've also shared a link in our uh, comment about the demo that we have given for the integration between sap business one and evable portal and don't hesitate to get back to us and wait for our uh, next video thank you